Hello guys, welcome back to Tech Projects. In this video, I'm going to show you how to push and export your Android project from Android Studio to GitHub. Please don't skip video. Every second in this video contain an information. One advice before watching this video, you must have your GitHub account. Also, you need to install Git into your PC and laptop. If you want to know how to do this following things, then I give a link of video in i button. So watch it and then proceed. One last thing, if you want to learn GitHub from start to end, then check out my playlist and watch the all four videos. You will definitely learn something great now let's start so the process for pushing code is same for all files first we create a github repo then we add and then we commit the code and at last we push it so for creating a github repository i open my browser and you can see my github account is already open and you can see and i have only one repository now for new repository just click on new give any name i give my login app now it's your choice whether you want to give description or not by default it is public if you want to make it private then you have to pay some fees or you can use bitbucket for private repositories now click on create repository and you can see the repository is successfully created now open your android studio and open your project which you want to push you can see this is my project and here my all java files and the layout files Now for pushing this project, first go on the top and click on VCS and now click on enable version control integration. Select git from here. Now click on ok. And you can see it show me a message for creating a git repository successfully. And the color of the file also changed to red means everything is going fine. But I am not sure the color of your files is changed or not so don't take tension about it. Now go on the top of the left side, click on the android and select project from here. I just minimize it. Now right click on the name of your project. Now go down and down and click on git. Now click on add and you can see it start adding file to VCS. Now you can see the file color and file name change to green means everything is perfect. Now again go to your project name and again right click with the help of mouse and click on git. And this time we have to click on commit directory. Give any commit message here. I give this is first commit. Now click on commit and you can see it start committing files. Here it show me a 1 error and 120 warning. For review that error, I just click on review to show you the error is nothing but you can directly click on commit here. When I click it, it show the error of migrate project to Android X. So hopefully guys you understand everything the my project is correct and there is no error. This is the only error due to the difference in version. It does not affect our project. Now we have to do the same procedure again. Now go to the name of the project, right click with the help of mouse and go to git and click on commit directory. And commit message already type here. Now click on commit. And again click on commit. After successful commit, below you can see it show a message that successfully committing the project. Now we have to push it on github repo. So again go to the name of the project and right click with the help of mouse and go to git. This time click on repository and now click on push. Now click on define remote. Now you can see a dialog box is open. Here the URL is empty. So here we have to paste our github repository URL. So for this I open my browser and on the top of the browser in search bar this is the URL. So just copy this and paste it here. Now click on OK. And now click on push. Below you can see it start pushing the project from Android Studio to GitHub repository. When you push code first time it asks for your username and password of your GitHub account. So just fill it and click on login. After pushing it, it show me a message of push successful means our project successfully pushed from Android Studio to GitHub repository. Now I again go to my browser and when I refresh my page and you can see the all code come here. So hopefully guys you understand everything. In the previous one video, I pulled the same code from GitHub repo to my Android Studio. Please check out this video too. If there is any query, comment down below and like the video and subscribe my channel for latest update. Thank you.